Yeah. How do you fight that temptation of um, always wanting to be successful for number's sake versus yeah. um, still wanting to lean in? Because you mentioned you want to do it yeah. to bring glory to God, right? How do you mm-hmm. how do you fight that temptation of doing those two things? Yeah, yeah, that's been very interesting for me because over the past year, 15 months, I've actually lost... I want to say like over 60,000 followers on Instagram. Mm. And I'm like, and it, it's been, a, it, I've let it really in a lot of ways control um, the type of stuff that I post or yeah. like cause me to overthink so much and be so concerned about, you know, numbers and engagement following. Oh, how can I keep this up? And again, right. taking me away from the reason I'm doing this in the first place. And like that desire I mentioned earlier about wanting to do this to, uh, reach as many people as possible um, can easily be misconstrued and like shifted into just numbers rather than I'm rather my goal being to reach M reach and impact individual people. Mm. So getting back to that um, and having that understanding when I post something that doesn't perform as well, rather than seeing like the gap in engagement, what I am seeing is like, the few individual people who are being impacted by it or like whose day is being right, brightened right. by it or um, who I'm able to help encourage through it. Yeah. So, um, yeah, remembering that this is about people, mm. not numbers. Mm. 